Okay, today we're going to do an A minor chord. Why A minor? Because we're going to be doing mostly everything so far is in the key of C. Uh, the key of C has no sharps and no flats. There's a scale of C. The pattern for a major scale, which is the major key we're in, the pattern for uh, the, the uh, eight notes, seven notes in a row are whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. That's the pattern of a major scale. If you start it anywhere on the keyboard and you follow that pattern, whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half, you will find the notes that you need in that major key. So suppose I said, now the key note would be C. We start on C, so it's the key of C. If we started on, say, D, this is the D, it would be the key note, and would follow that pattern. Whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half. So when we started on D and used our pattern, whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half, we had to alter two notes. D to the E, that's a whole step. E to the F is a half, but we needed a whole. So we had to raise the F, and raising it, you use the sharp sign. Then the F sharp to the G is a half, and the G to the A is a whole, A to B is a whole. We need a whole, but we only have a half. So we have to raise this C to a C sharp. And then the C sharp to the D is a half. So it's whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half. No matter where you start, that's the pattern. But let's go back to C. That's where we're going to be working around. We're, walking, we're working around the key of C. Now, we've done the C chord so far. That's the one chord in the key of C because it's the bass one chord. Okay, so we've done the C chord, which is the one chord because C is the one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. So the one chord in the key of C is the, one, is the C chord. The four chord, one, two, three, four, is the F chord, which we've done. Then, this is the four chord, so this is the five chord. And, so that we've done the one chord, four chord, five chord, in the key of C. Okay, so now today we're going to be doing the six chord in the key of C. The one chord in the key of C is major because of the two whole steps. The four chord is major because of the two whole steps, a major third. The G chord is a major chord because of the two whole steps. Now the other chords are minor or diminished. Now the one chord, major, two chord, is that major or minor? Well, you tell me. From the root to the third, the D, to the third is one and a half steps, so it's a minor third, and then from the middle of the chord to the top of the chord is two whole steps. So this is a minor chord, so that's a D minor. The two chord is minor. How about this one? Okay. Minor also. One and a half steps, two whole steps. E minor. Then we have our F major, G major. Now here, the sixth chord, one, two, three, four, five, six chord, is also minor. One and a half steps, and from here to here is two whole steps. So this is, the sixth chord is the minor chord. It's an A minor chord. Now this next one, the seven chord, is kind of tricky because it's one and a half and one and a half. So it is not major nor minor, it is called diminished. It's made smaller, it's smaller than the minor. It's one and a half, one and a half. And these are the chords that sound like horror chords in the movies. Use the sixth chord. One, two, three, four, five, six. Because most, about 2,000 songs are made up with those three major chords, C, F, G, and the A minor. So, you've all heard this years ago. C chord, one chord, 
A minor chord, 6th chord, F chord, 4 chord, G, 5 chord, 4 chords. Thousands and thousands of songs are made of this. In the still of the night. A minor, F major, G, C, A minor, F, G. So the same, that's a chord progression. One chord follows another. C, A minor, F major, G major. Heart and soul. Boogie woogies. I, I mean, uh, um, 50 songs. Well, the, the A chord, the A minor chord, is A, C, E. So we've got the F, G, C, A minor. Those four chords we're going to use. Now, I've revised my lead sheet, and I put in some of the A minor chords now. I put an A minor chord in here now. Uh-huh. A minor chord right here and an A minor chord here. This changes the whole sound of it. So here's my little lead sheet. We went up to here last week, or two weeks ago, so here's a C. F minor. Now we'll go down to the C. Up one, up to here in the C chord. Now go to the A minor. G, F, G, A minor, F minor, C, F minor, G major, C. Okay, if you don't know how to read the notes, we're going to start here. There's our G on the second line, and this first note starts space line, space line, two below the G. There's the G, space line, two below the G. So we start here on this note. We're going higher, line to a space, line to a space, up higher one. Space line, higher one. All you're using is your eyes to see which direction it goes and how many spaces and lines the notes go, higher or lower. That's how you read notes. You don't have to know the names of the notes. You don't have to know anything except use your eyes. You're on this note here. You're going down, lower, space, line, space, line. Higher line to a space. Higher space to a line. Lower space line. Higher one. Higher one to this line. Now there's a big jump, so we have to find out how many we're going up, how many spaces and lines. We're on this line, G, G line, G line. We're going up space, line, space, space, line, space. That's three notes, so we're going space, line, space. So we're going up to this note here. Now we're coming down lower, space to a line. Lower from here to here, line to a line. So we skip that space, skip that space and go to that line G. Now we're going line to the space lower. Now we're going down several, because it's a big jump. So we're going to count down line, space, line, line, space, line. Higher one to the space, higher one to the line. Lower space line, higher one to the space. Higher one to the line. Higher one to the space. Higher one to the line. Higher one to the space. Big jump. How many? We're on this note here. We're going up line, space, line. That's three. Line, space, line. Up to here. Coming lower. Line to a space. Space to a line. 
Line to a line is a skip to the G. Now we're going up, higher, space, line, space, space, line, space. Lower one, lower one, higher one, higher one, lower one, lower one, higher one, higher one, lower line space, line space, higher one, higher one. From here we're going lower, line space line, line space line. Lower one, lower one, higher one, higher one, lower one. Ooh, this is a big jump. Let's count how many. We're on this one and we gotta go up. Line, space, line, space, line. Line, space, line, space, line. Way up to here. Lower one, lower one, lower one, higher one, higher one. And the rhythm is the same throughout. The dotted white one is worth three. These together are worth one. So it's one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, 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 two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, one. One, 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 two, three, four and 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 two. And before I play the note, I have my hand on it, my finger on it. So while I'm sitting on this one, I'm already feeling this one here. I'm looking ahead like you look ahead when you read words. I'm looking ahead seeing it I hear and then I go to here. So I can just go. While I'm sitting here, I'm looking ahead seeing, okay, I got to do that same thing. I got to get down two and then up one. And then up one. Then I'm going to feel this one while I'm playing this one. 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 I'm already feeling this one, one to three down. I'm ready to play this one and feeling it down. I'm not waiting until I get to it. I'm feeling it ahead of time. High one. I'm feeling this one already ahead now. Feeling this one. Now I'm gonna feel this one ahead. And I'm feeling this one ahead. And I'm gonna feel this one way ahead. Feel ahead, feel ahead. Feel it before you play it. it makes it easier instead of just waiting till you get to it. Feeling ahead. Three, four, and why? Because when I write something like this, y your mind, your brain remembers rhythms and a continuing uh, repeating rhythm sticks in your brain better. Same with the, using a few notes. Okay, so what you're going to do this week is you're going to take this, the whole thing, and you're going to put it all in root position first because you have a new chord, the A minor chord. Now you have the four chords, the one chord in the key of C, the, four, the six chord, six minor chord, the four chord, and a five chord. With those four chords, you can play at least 2,000 songs. Pop songs even written today, they're using these same four chords. And once you play these in root position uh, for the week, then you can change them around and you can make, uh, you can have them playing open. F minor. melody.